Hey guys, it's Carpenter with Harvey Crazy. So, I just wanted to show you overcast today, and it is almost 6 o'clock. So, I'm not pulling in very many amps. My panel voltage, 12.9 volts, and I'm getting 1.2 amps right now. And I'm also running this small, very small uh, inverter that's charging a drill battery. You know, not running much. And... Let's see, battery is getting 0.6 amps at 12.9 volts. So, I mean, 12.9 volts, that's still fully charged. And the load, 0.5 to 0.6 amps. Not much at all. But what gets me is the state of charge says it's at 29%. When I plug this inverter in, and all that I ran is the inverter, one of my fantastic fans on low, and two lights. That's all that I've ran, and maybe for half an hour. When I plugged every, when I plugged the inverter in and turned on a couple things, my state of charge said 100%. I don't have much faith in this solar charge controller for giving me an actual state of charge when it's, you know, obviously this far off. Um, now I can look at my voltage and know the state of charge. You know pretty easily uh, but the state of charge on this charge controller is all messed up and that is one thing that I do not like about it I sent an email to Renegy to see what they might say in reply but uh, it is Saturday today we shall see you know there's there's not many reviews on this this Ustar PWM charge controller but I liked that I was able to actually change the charge voltages and all of that because for my deep cycle batteries I wanted to make sure that it got it up to 14.8 volts instead of you know 14.4 or 14.6 like a lot of the other charge controllers do. And I mean I don't know. This is making me kind of you know want to just you know get a maybe a Morningstar, TriStar you know, I'd probably still stick with PWM because I don't really think that I'm going to gain much from a uh, MPPT charge controller because I am running my panels in parallel and, I mean, heck, I have them on opposite sides of my roof with my roof sloped both different directions. And I did that on purpose because, you know, I park every which direction and who knows which direction I'm going to be facing towards the sun. And so, you know, I got them on both sides. You know, it, it won't be optimal ever but it should get you know better you know over the long haul just because I'm always changing but yeah just wanted to give you this small update on my charge controller I have been working working like crazy you can kind of see the water down there working on a boat down on the water got the bike and the RV just getting ready to go for a ride But yeah, I, I have been happy with my solar system, you know, everything's been getting charged, you know, reasonably quick, and I mean, I hardly use any power, so I'm not really all that worried about it, but I just really don't like that the state of charge indicates something totally different than I know that it is. Uh, what do you guys think about that? I mean, other than that, it's been working great, but it just, it says the wrong state of charge. Okay, well, let me know what you think about that. Talk to you guys later. Bye.